I want to show you how you can solder SMD components. That's what we need. Uh, soldering iron. Tweezers. We will need flux. Lot. Sin is better than bigger. Magnifying glass and a third hand, and of course our PCB. Let's start. At first, I put the flux on the pads where I want to mount a SMD IC. One side and the other side. And now I will place the IC. Take care for the orientation of the component. Okay, and now... I... place it directly on the pads. Now I solder one or two legs on the one side that it that the IC will stay in place. And now I start. I take a big blob on the soldering iron and then I just run through the pins. They will connect underneath by itself and the soldering flux will take care that they are not connected. If there is if there are some pins still connected then I can clean the soldering iron and go over this pin again like here. Uh, let's see. Okay now I've got it. Nice. <laughs> okay, so they are they look perfect. Okay, now let's go to the other side. I make flux on the pins again. And then I again take a big blob of a lot on the soldering iron and go over the pins again. It's a relatively easy technique. Okay, and they connect with the pads. Nice. So I'm sure you can do this a lot much better. So now let's take the other components. These are 0405 SMD parts and here I want to place resistors. I make lot on one of the pads, then I heat it up and the side of the resistor. Okay. Yeah, almost perfect. Okay, oh, I, uh, so it can be. And I heat up the other side. Okay. <laughs> it's actually not so easy with the camera between me and the PCB, but it will work. Okay, one side is attached and now here comes the other side. Okay, it's working. Again, first the pad. And I take the component. Yeah, and here we go. 
I'm sure you can do this much better. There is flux in the lot integrated and it should take the oxid on pads and components away that it can take the lot and best idea is to bring the lot on the hot component and on the hot pad and not on the hot soldering iron right so if you're familiar with soldering then I'm sure you know this So once again, there are a lot of tutorials of how to solder SMT components and this is only one way and a way what works very nice for me. So two more parts are missing. And this are capacitors too, and they have a bigger size. So some people ask if they will start with soldering, if they should start with THT through whole components at first, and I would say it just doesn't matter. You can start with SMD components, it is not so complicated. There are some tricky things and in THT soldering there are tricky things too. So, As you can see here, it is easy and it is very fast and I mean soldering a THT, as THT IC needs a lot of time and that here was much faster. Okay, so and if you're wondering, this is the LG motor control circuit, what you can purchase in the Fritzing sh shop. <laughs> of course. Okay, I hope you enjoyed it and see you next time. Bye.